Hello, all you hardcore boxing fans out there. How are you doing? Big Porky here, the voice of hardcore boxing. We all know that, don't we? Because that's why you're tuning in. Now, I keep hearing that. I don't want to be negative, but I just don't like being bullshitted and lied to. We keep hearing that boxing's booming. It's big. It's number one. It's better than ever. Somebody's just sent me something here. I can on channel John Ford, and I've added a bit of my stuff to it. But let's just look at let's just look at the statistics. I believe we've got six world champions in the sport of boxing in the UK. Well, let's have a look here. Tyson Fury, heavyweight champion, WBC belt. Some say he's the lineal champion. You could you could agree with that. You could say that, but hmm. he's got two elite wins. Two. Just two. Vladimir in his 40th year. And Wilder. Uh, he took Vladimir to university. And Wilder schooled him and then knocked him out. Right, so he, he can't. He can only beat us in front of him. He's also got a win over Steve Cunningham, a cruiserweight, in a life and death. But that was years ago. But getting back to the point I want to make is Tyson pay per view. Yeah, he's a pay per view. He does. He do, he's doing a lot of me, more media in it at the moment than boxing, keeping himself out there. He gets it. He gets it. The point I want to make though is this: he's not had a defense of a world title yet. And he's just got two elite wins. But let's look at all the other five, shall we? Let's look at them and see, and see, and see, see what we think about the other five. I need to get somebody to come and show me how to work all this stuff because I don't know what I'm fucking doing. Uh, Anthony Joshua. How many... How many elite wins would you say Anthony Joshua's got? Elite. Would we class Parker as elite? He'd not beat a champion by the time he fought Joshua, but he would, but he had a WBO belt. <laughs> Another Liam Smith job, isn't it? That. So Parker, you couldn't say he's elite. Povetkin passed his best, although that win's looking half all right now. You could give it, you could. Squeeze a Povetkin one, but at that age, could you? Well, we give Vladim, we give Tyson an elite win against Vladimir. We could squeeze him. He could squeak him with Povetkin, but question marks against it. Could he squeak him with a Vladimir win, Joshua? In his 42nd year, 18 month on settee, in his 69th fight. There's a question mark against that as well, isn't there? Andy Ruiz, could we say he's an elite win? No, but he beat Joshua. And Joshua beat him in rematch, but ran for his life. So there's a question mark over Anthony Joshua. And that's why I don't think they'll take the Fury fight next year. I think they'll keep him earning and do the best to swerve it. And Eddie will just front it out, won't he, with brass neck on him. But... Uh, so they're the heavyweights, the blue ribbon division. Boxing's booming. That's what Eddie Hearn tells us. Josh Warrington. Josh Warrington. Who was his elite wins? You'd say Frampton and Selby, wouldn't you? So he's got two elite wins. He's undefeated. He sells out arenas, so he's doing well, isn't he? But it's not the blue ribbon division, but... What's happening with Josh Warrington now, or what are they doing for him? Because we can't have any 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 fans in arena. He's in limbo, isn't he? He's a victim of his own success. So I'd say he's doing well. Josh Taylor. Who would you say Josh Taylor's elite win is? Postal? Question mark against that. Pro Gray. Yeah, you give him that one. Uh, so you could say one and a half, couldn't you? You could say Joshua. You'd give him half for Vladimir and half for Povetkin, wouldn't you? It, it's pretty threadbare, isn't it? 
other world champions, Callum Smith. How many elite wins has Callum Smith got? George Groves won elite. He'd had three defeats before he fought uh, Callum Smith, so he wasn't elite at all. So, and he were he were part injured. So yeah, you can't say Callum Smith's got an elite win. Has Billy Joe Saunders got an elite win? Well, he's beat Eubank for that for British Commonwealth and European, I believe, before Eubank went on to better things. He's beat Andy Lee, who were a light middleweight, stepped up, got a belt at 160. And he's beat David Lemieux, is it? David Lemieux. So, Taylor made for him. Who did he really beat? Golovkin flogged him. Golovkin were elite. So, Billy has not been in with an elite fighter yet. Not been in with an elite fighter yet. Uh, these are current world champions. I'm not going to put Frampton on list or Jamie McDonald because they don't have belts. So, looking at it from here, Fury, you could give him two elite wins. Joshua, Povetkin and Vladimir, question marks against them. Josh Taylor, Postel and Progre, you'd give him one, wouldn't you? Question mark against Postel. Warrington, uh, you could say Selby won. You could say Selby's an elite win. Frampton won, he'd only had one defeat. He could squeak by with them as elite wins. Two for Josh Warrington. Callum Smith, you can't give him an elite win, can you? Warrington, uh, sorry, Callum Smith and Billy Joe, you can't give them an elite win. You can't say Andy Lee, Lemieux and Eubank are elite wins, can you? So, looking at that lot, you'd say Tyson Fury, Taylor, Progre and Warrington. Probably Warrington has got the best CV out of all of them. But you'd have to go with Blue Ribbon Division and say Tyson, but you could put Warrington's CV up against Tyson's, couldn't you? You know, for what he's achieved, there's no draws on his record, sells out arenas, done everything, he's ticked every box, but Tyson's ticked every, every box, and he really. But point I want to make is, out of all the boxers in the world, we've hardly got any elite wins between all these, haven't we? What have we got here, two? What we've got, five elite wins and a couple of question marks against a few others. Is that it? Is that it? British boxing's booming. Eddie Heard's words, the Boominators. You know, to go on Boominators' channel, didn't he? Because he's booming more than British boxing at the moment. So don't lie to me saying that British boxing is booming when it clearly, looking at the statistics, isn't. There are six world champions. Six world champions. And out of these six world champions, I'm going to leave you with this before you like and subscribe. Share the video and leave a nice comment telling me how good looking I am. Tyson Fury, who got him his belt originally? Mick Hennessy. Who got him his belt back? Frank Warren. Joshua, Eddie Earn got him to world title. Taylor, Eddie Earn didn't get him to world title. Warrington, Eddie Earn didn't deliver him a world title. Callum Smith, Eddie didn't deliver for that. It was Callum Sowerland. Saunders, Frank Warren got in both his world titles. So out of our six world champions that we've got, Eddie Earns only really delivered for Joshua, has he? Am I right? He's a, he's on it's only world champion belt is delivered. And Joshua, when Olympic gold medalist, it were nailed on that we we're going to get a world title. So Eddie, stop telling me you're big and that you're number one because the statistics clearly says that you're not, are you? If you've only got Joshua as a world champion. Yeah, Callum Smith's a matchroom fighter, but you didn't get him his belt, did you? Just thought I'd pull you up on that evening, Eddie. All right, so peace out. Keep on trucking. Keep supporting boxing. All right, shout out to Innovation Alloys. Nice to speak to you today, AJ. Top man. Peace out.